actually, uh, uh, I think this year is going to be um, an absolutely extraordinary experience in terms of the illuminations. I think everyone is going to notice one very, very big difference, which is that the illuminations are lighter and brighter and more colourful than they've ever been before. Um, it's a new concept that we've been working on called colour choreography, which is about using the resources we've got to ensure that the illuminations have that kind of maximum impact. You know, I and the rest of the team are very aware of the fact that when people come to Blackpool, the illuminations are such an extraordinary moment, such an extraordinary iconic experience. It needs to have an enormous amount of impact. And the street landscape of Blackpool, inevitably, like everywhere else in the world, is changing with things like digital signage, with the way the colour is used, with the way the light is used, there could be a risk that actually the way the streets look ordinarily is so light, so bright, you know, actually the illuminations could be something of a letdown. So one of the big things that we focused on this year is to ensure that all of the festoons, all of the abstract illuminations, everything that creates that real sense of jewel box intensity as the summer ends, has been ramped up through LED digital technology. Um, this is a, a, a continuing process that started a couple of years ago. It's something that we're now using, um, for instance, even in the heritage illuminations, which is something that I've always been very passionate about. It means that we can relamp heritage illuminations to look as they've always been, but to use LED technology, which means we can change the color and we can obviously leave a much, much smaller footprint. Um, Gillian mentioned Circus. Circus is, uh, has already been switched on as, as befits um, its uh, uh, celebration, its birthday celebration. We've got two of the panels down there. And I think that this is a, a, a real step into the future for the way that I love the illuminations to go. There's a, a wonderful sense of tradition and heritage to the way that they look, but they very much harness contemporary technology as well. Um, as Julian says, our relationship continue apace. And this is, this is so incredibly important now to the newness of the illuminations. Without local businesses, without the support of the very local businesses that are actually so in, indebted to this extraordinary economic period of local illuminations, we can't do anything exciting. So it's wonderful to see um, companies that we've had such strong relationships with, like Council, um, who've been supporting the Alice Tower. in and wanting to use the illuminations as a way of literally putting their corporate message in light. You know, absolutely hardwiring who they are into the permanent geography 